Hello everyone, welcome back to Green Jacket Plays. I'm your host Green Jacket here with my co-host Endive and today I'm going to be playing The Projection. This is made by Professor Brink, the same man who brought us such classics as Nevermind the Clown, which I have yet to actually record and upload, as well as Crown of Extinction, The Four Horses. Uh, that video series I did a while back, the first video series I have completed so far. So I thought it would be fun to play another game that is um, confirmed by him to be connected, I believe. Don't quote me, but I'm pretty sure he said they're all connected. <laughs> so let's get started. Let's uh, get started. Okay. What the? Is this a cutscene or am I? Am I in here? Oh, there I am. Okay. All right. I couldn't figure out if I was like if this was a cutscene or what. Rise and shot. Rise and shine, Sleeping Beauty. You got a job to do. You might be a little annoyed that we had to wake you up a little early. 84 years, to be exact. Unfortunately, the ship hit a rather big meteor shower, and you are the designated mechanic. The colonists are still safe and under cryogenic sleep. We haven't lost anyone. But you need to understand, you have a lot of repairs to finish. If everyone on this ship is going to arrive with the colony safe. It's so just my hair, because I look derpy. Now I look vaguely Hitlerish. All right. If you haven't picked up that glowing light, it's a flashlight add-on to your suit, for your suit. We are running on backup power and I don't want you to bump into anything. You got it, baby. Woohoo! I got a flashlight, yeah. What's this? Weird cryogenic tubes, all right. Oh, okay, oh, all right, let's. Didn't mean to do that, but... Scary noises. What is this? Okay, that's nothing, actually. Oh, that's me. That's me breathing into my mask. Here's another... Wait, is this, like, outside? I wasn't joking about the damage to the ship. This entire section is pretty much zero hull integrity. Yeah, I can... I can see that. A lot of... A lot of, uh... A lot of space there. Yeah. Crazy. Good thing you have mag boots on or you would be flying away into the stars. Hold shift to use boost if you find yourself in an area where the hull is exposed. But be careful not to run into any hazards. What does that mean, hazards? So much to explore. Okay, well, I can't go that way. Oh, okay, that's um, part of the wall, I guess. That is so loud. Ooh, what's this? Oh. Oh, okay. Can't, uh, can't go that way. Oh, oh, whoa. Whoa, I just entered somewhere. Whoa. What? Shit, I can't go back. <laughs> ah, I might have missed something. I hate that. You can use this device here on the wall next to me in the corner to save your progress. Okay, so I gotta look for one of those little things. Yes, save progress. Yeah, there we go. I played this like forever ago, but I it was months ago and I completely forgot everything about it. So I figured I'd just start fresh. I don't remember like anything. Looks like an instruction manual. Teleporter activation code. Step one, arm the wormhole lens unit using controls terminal located at the end of the bridge. Step two, simply return here and step on the lens. Warning, remember to update teleporter settings. It is a waste of time and resources to be teleported to the same place. Each time you use the teleporter, always activate Control's terminal and return here. Alright, I probably should have been paying attention to that. Ew. What are those noises? Always be aware of your surroundings and barriers. Be alert to surprises. Alright. It's an email from one crew member to another. Looks like everyone is going to be put asleep as soon as we leave the solar system in eight days. To reach the new colony, it's going to take 1,000 years. That is a long time. It doesn't matter, though, because we have no choice. Earth was destroyed by classified. Why is it classified? You're. Why does it need to be classified? If you're like the last survivors, who gives a shit? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. 
It looks like someone was using this computer to play video games. Shame on you. That's probably what caused all this hull integrity. Maybe they were playing Asteroid. You know, they think Classified was created by our government and it went rogue. I can't even begin to imagine what's happening back on Earth. From the last few scans, we took... Oh, from the last few scans we took, it looks like hell. It's going to be okay. We have left all that behind. There's only the future now. Yeah, that stopped for a second and scared me. Found it. it! Appears to be a newspaper. Check out the headline. World Health Organization Fails. Millions Infected Across Asia and Europe. Curse you World Health Organization and your failure. Ah, <laughs> oh, fudge! Jeez, sickles. I uh, don't know what to do with that. Can, can I go back? Can I go back? What am I doing? Oh god, am I... Am I... Okay, nothing over here. That's a thing. Yep, 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 yep. Let's adjust the microphone real quick so that way it's not uh, catching so much of that. Yeah, I see a spider friend. Oh god, I'm like. Haha, <sighs> get dunked on. Alright, so that's weird that I can only run in space. I see you, bud. I see you. Can I? Oh, 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 God. Oh, wait, I saw that. You slippery devil. Is that? No, that's not a. Oh, shit. Sorry. That is not a save point. It's just a cord on that. All right. Well, that is rather unfortunate. It looks like the ship's holographic systems are breaking down. Usually, they are reserved. They are reserved for entertainment, but they appear to be running wild. They would be perfectly harmless, but the laser settings are way too high. If you touch them, they might kill you. Looks like we've got some work to do. <laughs> I don't know why, it just reminds me of FNAF Sister Location. Or, um, Pizzeria Simulator. <laughs> you can jam the signal by turning off the radar. Take the teleporter from the docking bay. Okay, so that means I gotta go back. Is there anything else in here? Nope. Cool. Alright. Let's -a go. No. Ooh. Get drunk. Ugh. Excuse me, spider friend. Can you not? Who would? I know it's who. Why? Why is this someone's entertainment? Ooh, man. I did not think I was gonna make that. All right. I don't know what that is. That hole in the wall. Then. Um. Excuse me. That was, um, uh... am I in a castle? Because that's stained glass. I am in a church now. Who uses stained glass on a spaceship? That is just right there. That's probably why the frickin' hole disintegrated or whatever it is. What's this? Hole, that is a lot of blood. That's nasty. Okay. So, I know that, like, alright, if this is related to the other games, this is... Okay, that shift. Okay. <laughs> this probably, this might be just one big, um, simulation, if it's related to the coffin tree thing. Okay. Ah! Oh, I... mm -hmm. Brink, yo, you are an asshole. I probably should have been timing myself on this. Oh well. There's those nasty noises again. It honestly sounds like he made this sound effect by like slurping on, on a drink with like the last dregs. Just that... <laughs> Teleport! Ooh. Ew. Oh! Ugh, are those bugs? I don't think those are actually holograms. I think I was wrong. The meteorites which tore apart the ship must have been contaminated with alien life. You have no choice but to activate the distress beacon from the end of this radar dish. Okay, I thought it was gonna come get me. 
You can float directly through space here, but don't go too far away from the railing. I can float through space? How do I do that? I want to float through space. Oh, God. Ah! Man, how far back is that going to take me? All right. Oh, it's going to take... I forgot to save. I'll be right back. Okay. All right, I'm back. Weird how my flashlight doesn't work out here. Ah! Missed him. All right. Let's try this again. I want to explore out there, but like... Okay, so it appears I can't go that way. See, the fact that I can go out in space makes me think that, like, there's something out here to explore. Thought I died for a second. Okay, well, nothing back here, it seems. Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to back away. All right, I can't do anything here. All right, so I didn't see anything. See, the fact that you can sp Okay, still bugs, but now I'm in snow. Okay. All right, enough with the bugs, please. White Foundation Hunting Lodge. I'm just gonna turn that down. Members only access. Private property trespassers will be prosecuted. Anything over here? I don't see nothing. My earball is itchy. Alright, let's go. And then... That is me. Oh, I shattered. Alright, well it is pretty cold out there. Uh, that's what happens whenever you try to love yourself. Ah, no hidden secrets. I always hope for hidden secrets. Can I go through the back? Nope. Guess not. Alright. Let's go inside. Repair station. Rise and shine, Sleeping Beauty. You got it. Uh. What? Um. What? I'm gonna have to go with the. Um, uh. Huh? What? What? What just. Okay. If this is gonna be some sort of like PT type thing, I'm. I'm tell you. I'm out. I'm out right now. Can't handle that. Nothing. Okay. The good news is, I guess I didn't miss anything. Can I go that way? No, I can't. Um. Yes, please. Does this say... Okay. Don't like that. What is... What am I... See, I can't run here. Ah! Dink. Get out of here. Oh my god! Guess that's not the way I'm supposed to go. Jeez Louise. All right, let's try this again. Oh, that means I gotta go back there. Okay. So I do have to go there, because I, I don't really have anywhere else I can go. Oh, okay, there we go. Maybe this way? Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, wait, no, never mind. I guess I was there before. See, look at that fast little bugger. Oh, my God. What am I supposed to do against that? Okay, so he can't come through there, apparently. Thought it... Mm -hmm. I don't need this from you right now, Phil. Phil, I'm hey, Phil. I'm going through a lot right now. I'm gonna need you to back off. Mm, thought I could juke him, and I didn't realize it came out of the top. 
gotta be something I'm missing here. Oh! Oh. Never mind. Thought this was the thing I was missing. See, look, there it is. There's gotta be a way past it. I can't run here. Can't turn off my flashlight. Fail. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna make it past this thing. There's one thing I'm doing for this freaking playthrough. It's making it past this. So he's activated now. I know he can't come over here. Oh! What? He can some. What? <sighs> Brink, you are destroying my sanity. Just one slow little bit at a time. If I can run there, that means this place has oxygen. Since I can't run in here. I'm assuming. Okay. I can make it. No. No. But. I need you to. I need you to not. Boom. Son. Mm hmm. Phil, you can get on out my face. Okay. Well, this is quite the conundrum. All right. Well, I guess I'll have to figure it out next time because I'm way over time. I'm going to have to cut a lot. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, hope you're enjoying it so far. Uh, I am looking forward to unlocking the mysteries of this game and seeing how it fits into the overall thing that is Coffin Tree. Um, but I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Keep your jacket screen. And yeah, see you later. Oh, also, there's still a contest on my Facebook and Twitter as to guess the next uh, long series that I'm going to be doing on my channel. So go check it out on my Twitter and Facebook and see you guys later.